We do apparently have another AMC glitch. I always like to cover these glitches, quote unquote, in my videos and a half for over two years now. This is AMC to do see the glitch at 4.04 p.m. And apparently there was a massive, massive amount of buying pressure for a split second. The bigger question is, will any of these other glitches that have been happening over the past few years ever be looked into? As of right now, it seems like no. But comment down below what you think is actually going on and why there are so many glitches with this one single stock. This ape says AMC and ape. Pre-reverse split. $500 is not the MOAS. It's FOMO buying. $1,000 is not a MOAS. FOMO buying plus a few small family offices covering. $5,000 is not the MOAS. FOMO buying plus small family offices covering. 10 k per share plus starts the MOAS. 10 k to 100 k per share is the MOAS, this ape says. So what I want you guys to do is comment down below. What's your real floor price at this time and how much would you actually sell for? Let me know in the comments. This ape says I think we're missing the big point. Court says no bankruptcy imminent, but CEO Adam Aaron says bankruptcy is imminent. If this thing squeezes the 3.5 million per share, just like we all anticipated doing, Adam Aaron can sell his fat position himself and pay off the debt. And I'm sure many of you cran eating regards would donate a couple milli to help eliminate the debt as well. Instead of hyper focusing on whether AMC should dilute or not, maybe AMC should focus on all efforts of making this thing fly out of the stratosphere because this is a play that's influenced by the forces to manipulate the markets, not the fundamentals of the business. Let's all agree on one thing, if AMC squeezes, we can pay off debt and our Lambos. Not financial advice, of course. This ape says it's hard to feel sorry for those that still use Robinhood, but still. So just a word of caution, guys. When it comes to buying and selling stocks, do your own research and try to make the best informed decision you can when it comes to which brokerages you want to use and trust, and just please take that with a grain of salt. But this ape says picture says it all, Robinhood is shady AF. So today I exited my cash secure puts with a good profit and attempted to open a new AMC position. However, Robinhood didn't accept my order and displayed an error message and said, uh oh, there's some unknown error, try again later. I waited a bit and tried again, but the issue persisted. Frustrated, I decided to take a look at the API responses. Long story short, it turns out that the so-called unknown error isn't that unknown at all. In reality, Robinhood artificially limits the number of option contracts you can hold on AMC. Make sure to check out all these other videos to catch up on all the latest AMC Stock DD and information you need.